the toughest matchup you've had in those one-on-one -on -one drills? Uh, I think, I think for me it's probably uh, Isaac, um, but I think going one-on-one, -on -one, I think everybody kind of bring their own challenge. Um, everybody do things well, and um, you just all them guys kind of make us better. What's so Rock what's make? Nah, I, I never heard of that one before. <laughs> Yeah, um, I kind of use that to my advantage. Um, like you say, it's, everybody got little things uh, to that game to help them out, and that's one of my uh, unique skills. How do you feel about the fact that Jordan is probably likely to take away some of your nose tackle snaps and put you more in that four-eye tech and maybe give you more time to I mean, give you more opportunity to get one-on-ones? I mean, I love it. Yeah, whatever uh, really the team need me to do, I'm down to do. Um, but I like playing the four-eye and the three and the nose, so it don't really matter where I play it on this defense. What are your impressions? I just feel like we, um, we all playing faster, just knowing um, what we got to do. And um, you just see improvement from everybody, um, everybody taking a step forward from last year. Last year, No, I haven't really talked to them much about that, so it's just, it is what it is, and uh, right now it's just uh, more focused on the football part. What are your impressions of Jordan Davis so far? I mean, I think it's like everybody else. He, he, he a big boy who can, uh, just a massive dude who, who really can get out of it. You mentioned Isaac in those one-on-ones. What, what makes him so difficult when, in that type of atmosphere? He's real crafty. Um, He's just a unique player. He uh, he don't show much. Uh, he's a balanced offensive lineman, and really he's just a, a vet player who really knows what he's doing. Is that the most difficult to deal with offensive linemen who kind of don't tip anything and you don't know what they're trying to do? Yeah, when people can really switch up their sets or don't show their hands, that's it's one of the most difficult people, players to uh, go up against, and he's kind of a vet at doing things like that. Which backup player is the question most? backup? Yeah. I don't really, we don't really call backup players for us. It's just a, I think uh, uh, Marlon, uh, you can see how much he done jumped from uh, his first year to his second year. And you just see him improving every day. And then got a lot better since last year.